Good afternoon, everybody. Sorry you can't see my face, but this is Marsha from Oils and Mornos with Marsha, and today I'm making homemade cocoa. The weather's starting to get colder out. So, this is the recipe I use. I take powdered milk, scissors, I'm just going to cut with a knife to open it up. I really pour it up now <laughs> since I pour it so much. I'm gonna hold this down. And then I'm gonna put two cups of powdered milk and just pour it in here. Uh, it's really not supposed to be pouring like this. So I'm gonna try my hardest not to make a mess. my cocoa, I mean my cocoa, two cups of powdered milk, and put it in my bowl, there's one, and here's two, Two cups of the powdered milk. And I have powdered sugar. And I take the same amount of powdered sugar as I do the powdered milk. I'm trying to get it to fall down so it don't fall out when I cut it open. Okay. Cut that open. Fill my cup up with the powdered milk, I mean sugar. There's one cup. Now my second cup. Then you need your cocoa. I have one half of a cup of cocoa. Mix all the ingredients together. You can use a whisk, but I'm using my spoon. I'm going to put a cup of hot water, a cup of water in the microwave to heat it up so I can put my cocoa in it when it's done and have a cup of cocoa. You can, I can finish mixing it up while the water is getting hot, and it will be prepared, ready for my cocoa. Oops, making a mess now. Get all the chunks that might be in there loosened up.
case you're wondering about my throat and my ribs. Um, my throat's getting better. I've been drinking a lot <clears throat> of drinks, warm drinks, to help soothe it with my thieves' essential oils in it. But my ribs, if I cough, it hurts. If I laugh, it hurts. I, it's hard to turn over in bed. But it'll get better. You just gotta, it's just got to get calmed down. Okay, I've got my, my cocoa. Let me show you what the cocoa looks like. Got my cocoa all mixed up. I'm going to get my, my cup of hot water over here. Add the cocoa to it. Some hot water right here. I'll put three three heaping spoons is what I'm gonna do. Three heaping spoons. One, two, three. I'm gonna stir that up. A fast way to get a cup of hot cocoa on a chilly day or evening whichever you want and I also like to put uh, some peppermint from Young Living Essential Oils inside my cocoa so I'll put a drop in there to get you closer so you can see what that's happening let me see here i just go like that don't know. I'm trying to get my hmm. Maybe it's out. I guess I won't be putting no peppermint in there because it's out. That's a bummer because I was looking forward to peppermint in my cocoa. Anyway, my cocoa is ready. Smells like there's peppermint in it. Maybe it is. I didn't see any drip. But I can sure smell it. And there's peppermint in it. Oh, it must have dripped. I thought I was. I thought it was empty, but it, this just tastes so good. I can. I can feel it opening up my my nostrils. Open up my nostrils. Open up my nasal passages. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed this recipe uh, of hot cocoa. I will put it in the description below in case you want to make your own. Put it in a mason jar, put a lid on it, and then you can have cocoa whenever you want a cup of cocoa. I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Ta-ta!